Our two regions and the entire world uh, began to have to uh, deal with one of the biggest uh, social, economic and political uh, challenges of recent times, namely COVID-19. This uh, highlighted once again the huge uh, social and economic uh, gaps that exist. The increase in the uh, poverty and suffering indexes uh, and uh, made worse today by the regrettable and unjustified uh, uh, war on Ukrainian soil. That is why I would like to express uh, some of our proposals to this August uh, forum. This is uh, the message that we would like to address to you here at this summit. We need to strengthen the mechanisms for the restructuring of debt with the aim of mitigating the social difficulties caused by the recent crises. These initiatives uh, could include strategies uh, for debt uh, cancellation, debt exchange and uh, debt restructuring. All of that has to be subject to the conditions that there has to be investment in education, health, uh, industry and uh, social cohesion. We should encourage the creation of uh, healthy reserves and uh, food banks. We have to ensure the empowerment of communities. We have to modernise uh, agriculture culture, economic, uh, social and environmental sustainability is necessary. Vaccines uh, should be universally accessible and free for all human beings. We beseech you to act rapidly and to take concrete measures uh, in the short, medium and uh, long term to fight uh, climate change and uh, to mitigate the consequences of this climate change. Uh, if we do nothing, the results will be catastrophic. This is a summit that lays the ground for our common future, so connecting with civil society and our youngsters is a must.